Hey, what's up, nerds? How you guys doing today? Hopefully, you're having a great day. Hopefully, your week's going well. I'm gonna be doing a head shape for you. I got about three days growth on the head, and I'm excited to uh, knock it down. I'm gonna be using some uh, new products today. Um, some, well, some new, some I've never new to me, and some I've just never done a head shape with. So, I'm gonna start with the Hazelettes Apothecary uh, Liquid Lightning. Pre-shave oil, give that a shot. Because I'm going to go straight in against the grain with this head shave. So I want to see how the the oil, oh, let me shake it up. So as you sh shake it up. See how the oil helps going straight against the head shave. Got a good amount there. And um, I'm originally from Southern Nevada. And maybe you guys have seen in the news or, or heard about the uh, terrible attack they had there with the gunmen opening fire. Um, at the uh, country music festival, just a terrible, terrible act of violence, and um, just our thoughts and prayers are with the people of Las Vegas in that area. I lived about 45 minutes from um, Las Vegas, and so we know that area well, and and uh, have been to those hotels and those casinos. So it's sad to see um, tragedy like that occur. Alright, we're going to be using, this is a soap I got from the Shave Meetup. It's a Shaver Heaven. It's made in Australia. So this made me think when I saw this, I thought a Chris from Another Cut Above, Spencer, Tony Tony, Abe. Um, I'm pretty sure you guys are from Australia. I see you guys in the comments a lot and I'm pretty sure you're from Australia as well. But I could be wrong. But Spence and Chris... Um, this made me think of you. This is Shaver Haven Heaven Shaver Heaven, the Teller, and it's it, incense, patchouli, amber, and vanilla. And I love I love patchouli. It's got a great scent. I really like this. Good fall scent. The weather's cooling down here, and it's just a nice fall scent. So that's what I'm going with. And I got out the Beast, the Maggard. 33 mil, or 30, sorry, 33, 30 millimeter knot, the, the black and white, the tuxedo synthetic. So that's what I'm going with for the head shape, so I'm excited um, to be using this. I've wanted a bigger knot for a while now, and I'm glad, I'm grateful to Maggards for donating it, and glad I, I won it at the raffle. So when I saw they had these out, I was hoping at the raffle I would win a, uh, one of their brushes, so. Alright, that should be plenty. Oh, it smells good. It's a little, it's probably medium scent strength, not, not a ton on the scent strength, but decent. Smells really nice, and this is a nice soft brush. Let's just get that on there, and we'll start painting in some water. was a little different about this brush with is the handle um, the handle has really good girth to it it's it's nice and wide it's a big you know in your hand you can really hold on to it I just wish it was a little longer
little more water, and this is creating a nice, quick lather. Okay, my only knock on this soap so far is I wish it was a little uh, stronger, a little stronger scent. My wife's great. My wife hates patchouli. She absolutely hates. Well, I shouldn't hate it. I shouldn't say hate. She just thinks it smells like dirt and bug spray. And so, <laughs> um, I love it though. I absolutely love patchouli. So when I smell it, I, I usually pick it up. And um, yeah, this is. I just wish this was a little stronger scent. But man, this brush. Creating a really good lather, really good lather. I'm gonna make it a little more water into it. And guys, I know I might have already talked about this actually, but uh, Cincy Shaves. Um, if you haven't seen Cincy Shaves, if you haven't checked out his YouTube channel, check it out. He's got some awesome awesome content on there he he's uh he tries all sorts of different products and blades that are unmarked and uh you know cans shaving creams he'll just review anything and it's it's great he's got really good content anyhow in one of his last videos he talked about my mccurr future versus progress video and how the progress tore up my neck a little bit um and I honestly think that's more due to the blade. Feathers and my face don't get along very well. And I shouldn't have chose feathers. I don't know why I chose feathers to do the review with. And uh, I think had I used a different blade, it would have been a different experience. So. All right guys, that is a good thick lather. Smells good. I mean, look at that brush. It's just got a ton in there. Um, and it loaded a whole lot. I, I loaded it less than I would have my other brushes, so. Really nice. Alright guys, so for the shave, I'm using the Maggard Version 3 Standard. Not the Aggressive, just the Version 3 Standard. And it's got a Crystal uh, Super Platinum star blade in it. I'll show you the the wrapper. Well, let's see. Hopefully, If you guys have seen these, the, the little tuck it came in just said made in Israel. Um, it didn't say a brand on it. it didn't, the blade itself. So I've heard these called crystals. I've heard them called Israeli personas, so I'm not sure, but that's what I'm going with. I, I think it's the crystal. From the research I've done, most people call it the crystal. So here we go against the grain. So far, really good. No, no pulling, no tugging. Very nice and smooth. Very nice and smooth. I hear my kids, they're getting up, getting ready for school. So if I have to pause for a minute, that means one of them needed to come, come into the bathroom for something. Yeah. <laughs> my youngest is talking with my wife right now. Ha <laughs> ha. 
kids are kids are awesome. <laughs> Crack ups. But I can hear it coming down, so we'll be back in just one second. Alright guys. We're back. Um my daughter had to come grab some stuff and I was kept going while she was in here just so the lather didn't dry out on my head too much. And uh I am really impressed with this setup, the version three, the standard, the not aggressive. I didn't think it was gonna be very efficient or smooth and, and we'll see, I guess, when I rinse and go to my touch up pass. Um so far it feels really good, really smooth, um efficient. There's no uh not tugging or pulling at all and feels really good. So I'm happy. Happy, happy with that. I wish this soap had a little stronger scent, but I, I like strong scents. I think I have a weak nose, and so I really like um, stronger scents. First pass feels really good and smooth. Oh, I'm still all right back here. Really, really good. Alright, let's rinse. Rinse, see how she feels, see how much touch up I'm gonna need to do. That feels fabulous. That is uh, really, really nice. There's a little bit of touch up on the back where there always is, but Man, that was a good, really good, really, really good. I'm, I am, uh, I'm a little bit, uh, confused maybe would be the right word. I don't know, a little surprised, confused, because I thought, like, you know, you hear everybody talk about the slants being so good and efficient, and they are, and maybe I'm just using mine wrong because, um, man, using this, uh, version 3, non-aggressive, just the standard, has given me just as good, if not better, results than, uh, I've ever got with the slant. So it could be, definitely could be that uh, these are just more forgiving, like with blade angle and and things like that. But I am 
really, really impressed with uh, the version 3 and the version 3 aggressive. By Maggard, just super impressed with how well they've done. Wow, really impressed. I mean. I know this video is going to be a little shorter because of a little interruption, which is fine, but, uh, you know, it was only maybe a minute or two at most, and, uh, oh, maybe a little more than that, um, just a few minutes, though, and for, uh, it, it's shocking to me how little touch-up is needed, how efficient that was. Right here, right here, always my tough spots to get smooth. Just always hard to hit every angle just right. Seems like the hair grows every different direction right there. Well, that is, oh, found a little bit. I really enjoy being able to hear my daughter play the piano in the morning, most mornings. Oh, not most, but uh, some of the mornings I have to leave to work before they're awake. And so it's nice when I get to be in here, you know, shaving and enjoying the shave and hear my daughter playing the piano in the background. It just is a... It's a good morning, a good life. All right, guys, that is, I am super impressed. I'm almost, like I'm trying to work through it in my mind. Now there's still a ton of good lather down in that, that brush, and uh, didn't, didn't need to load very long, and it just, and look at all that, just excellent lather. Um, really good slickness on the lather, um, easy to build. I just wish the strength of scent was a little higher. Um, but I'm a, I like strong scents. That's so. All right, I'm gonna rinse. Be right back and uh, finish off the shave. So we'll see you in just a sec. All right, guys. Carry shaves face wash or head wash all done. Feels good. And do my arm block. It's a little bit more than I was expecting above my ear area, right over here. Um, not bad. thought on the back of my head than I would get. That's interesting. Feels good. Feels good. A little bit. A little bit of burn. Nothing terrible. Uh, I like a little bit of the burn anyways. I don't mind it. So... All right, let's uh, let that dry for a little bit. We'll run down a little bit what we used. So, 
The Maggard, 30 mil. Uh, really nice. This is my first use with it. Um, nice and soft. Um, created a really quick lather. I, I really like that. I didn't have to spend a whole lot of time, you know, going back for water. And, and I mean, I'm sure the size helps um, creating a thick lather. So, um, without having to, you know, it can hold so much water and, and soap in it that. Uh, just awesome. I, I really enjoyed that for my head shave. I was, I think it might be a little big to do a face lather. I mean, we'll see. I'll try it. Um, but really nice on my head. So that was really good. Um, and then the shaver heaven, the teller performed really well. Good slickness, easy to lather. Um, good awesome scent. I, I really like this scent. I just wish it was a stronger scent. Um, wish it had a stronger scent. And then this guy's blowing my mind a little bit right now. I'm, um, I don't know what to think. The Maggard Virgin 3 um, Standard just gave a really good shave, really efficient, really smooth. I mean just a really good Really good shave, and I'm I'm a little baffled because it was better, without a doubt, than what I get from my slant. It was sorry. It was easier, quicker, um, without a doubt, than what I do from my slant, and uh, more efficient. And so it's kind of rocking my world, but. So it goes, I'm just going to keep rotating them and, and maybe it's just me with the slant, maybe I just need to get better and, and improve and then it will take over, but for right now, the version 3 Aggressive and version 3 Standard, the Aggressive I, I, is what I used on my, my, silent, my Sunday Silent Shave, my Silent Bob Shave, Abe, I'm going to name my next one that, and uh, they blew me away, it, they, they were by far better than what I can get with my slant. So that just might be me, my user error, but yeah, I'm kind of shocked. So gonna finish off with Dr. John's Defiance. It's a wonderful, cool weather, fall scent. Um, and shaver hit, it, I think it goes well with uh, the soap I used. So yeah, finish off with that. It's mentholated, got a little alcohol in it I think, let me make sure, I know it's mentholated, yep, got some alcohol, witch hazel, rose water, some fragrance, smells, I love the scent, my wife hates it, I love it, it's alright, um, whew, can feel that menthol now, feels good, feels really, really good, a little burn, a little menthol, Alright guys, there you have it. Good shave, great shave. Uh, gave me some stuff to think about. What, what, uh, what I'm going to do with my slant and how I'm going to get better at it or if I'm just not, if the slant just isn't for me. So, um, but thanks for watching this guys. Hopefully you're having a good day. Hopefully life is going well for you. Um, please comment. I love the comments. I like getting back to you guys. I know sometimes it can take a couple of days due to my work schedule, but I love commenting back and forth. You can see maybe some red coming in from the menthol and the, uh, yeah, it, it is lighting me up a little bit right now. But as I was saying, I love the comments. I love going back and forth with you guys, hearing your input, you know, learning from you guys. I got a lot to learn, so I appreciate the comments. So please keep them coming. Please comment, please subscribe, please share. Thank you to all the new subscribers. Um, I appreciate it. I have fun making these videos. Hopefully you guys enjoy something watching them, even if it's just to poke fun and laugh at me. That's fine too. Hopefully you find something enjoyable, but please be safe. Have a good day, and we'll talk to you guys later. Bye.